And I would, I would like to introduce three organizations from Ukraine, from Kiev or, or, or region, Liga Kultura and Twórcza Inicjatywa. And I've been working for 10 years. We deal with the development of culture and uh, human relations, uh, uh, human to human relations and also human to God relations. Can you hear me? Yes. <coughs> so the motto of our activity is uh, start from yourself, and that is why we start everything from ourselves. So we start uh, the development of the culture and the human relations. We start from ourselves. And although in our country uh, there is still a lot of this external dirt, uh, but but uh, in our society, we can see that people try uh, not to overuse words and their thoughts, not to, not to offend, to think positively. Uh, think about the good causes. I have also a presentation. Uh, just a couple of uh, illustrations. So, but I will read out some things from my slides. So we talk about coming back to our roots, to Christianity. And in our country, we also have a lot of uh, uh, challenges. But the mainstream uh, religious, uh, religious stream is the Christianity and orthodoxy. Orthodoxic beliefs. And when we talk about human rights, uh, uh, first of all, we put emphasis on the men's obligations uh, given us by Moses, but uh, they are. But, uh, so, sorry, I forgot the word here, uh, but they are not maybe tran transformed, but uh, they are ranked to a higher level by Jesus Christ. And uh, we talk uh, if so we can read such, uh, such Mo Moses, so Moses writes uh, that uh, don't kill, don't kill, that uh, as so you will not uh, deflame uh, your uh, relative. Uh, so 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 you ha so your speech should be yes or no, very clear. So that was uh, the so 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 people talked about uh, lies. So you have to love your relative, your neighbor, and you will hate your enemy. The Christ said that you have to uh, like your enemies and you have to pray for those who persecute uh, uh, you. No. And we are trying to follow Moses' commandments, and we try to uh, to follow Jesus Christ's lessons, and we've worked out some boards. Uh, and everybody can feel his or her personal development. And as of today, human rights, uh, even the fundamental rights uh, to live, uh, I think that I will not, I think, give examples. Everybody knows Georgia, what is in the eastern part of Ukraine. So if we mention the terrorist acts in France, in Germany, in Belgium, what does it mean? We know that the majority of society is impacted by elites. So this means that the basic human rights are threatened. We have an elite crisis in the world. Uh, in uh, our areas, uh, 
And that is why, first of all, we have to think about a new elite uh, for our uh, areas. What elite I am talking about? If we take the citizens, so among citizens we have uh, their own elite. We have military elite. We have legal elite, scientific elite, cultural elite. Uh, so what else and religious elite which which uh, which connects us uh, with uh, God uh, so so we have many challenges and the challenge from Moscow is such that um, different people come ortho orthodox persons and so I ask all persons who are not from the uh, from Moscow so we can see what happens to religious elite, uh, elites and each elite uh, uh, has its uh, own mission to think about future because ordinary men thinks about today the official who works in state institution thinks about today tomorrow and tries to uh, fill in gaps. If we would talk about the elites, is to think about the future, about uh, about this uh, uh, about this uh, European home that we think about. And each elite has three functions. Uh, it means uh, save, cure, and educate. So if this elite can be judgmental for itself, then can cure the society uh, 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 from all the illnesses. If this elite can cure uh, and if this elite educates people how to live farther, each elite has uh, three levels, high, medium, and low. I believe and this is uh, the opinion of our organizations uh, that we cannot interfere with the elites uh, but people the ruling people have to work out the criteria and set the direction for this movement for a elite and we think and we uh, formulated principles which for a reasonable man uh, so means that we shouldn't use uh, uh, trash uh, words and if we use them we have to clean it up so we have to obey the law we have we cannot break rules a wise man obeys the law uh, so a wise man uh, says share your knowledge uh, don't be judgmental about teachers doctors uh, but try to understand them and the wise man says uh, try to preserve heritage don't forget your obligations you have to remember do not be harmful to yourself and I would like to say that if we uh, have intercast uh, a center where well, on our boards, on our studies uh, relating to knowing oneself, so we educate these a uh, these elites which uh, teach teachers. So we have to start from teachers, parents, these ones who educate children, because. God will give a child to parents. So if parents do not know something, they uh, they, they can ask teachers. Uh, and if teachers do not know something, 
or they do something wrong, so then they can ask doctors or other educators, and if parents, teachers, and doctors uh, do not do their job, so then who works is a judge. And so we have to continue this education of elites and so that elites can focus on this educational aspect of development.